You're watching Lexi's Life. Hey y'all, happy new year and welcome to Lexi's Life. This is my first video in 2023. Um, I wasn't planning on making a video today, but after what I just got through doing, I said I definitely need to go ahead, make a video. This is a shopping haul video because I just left Target and TikTok made me do it. It is January 6th and the Black History line is already out in Target. It was actually there a couple of days ago because I've been seeing TikToks about it over and over again. So I was like, let me go on Target and see if my Target has it. Because on this side of town, we are the minority. And the first two years, I ain't saw nothing in Target. And I would have to go to the other side of town to get anything. And by the time I would do that, everybody would have done took everything. Last year, they did really good. This year, excellent. I'm going to insert a clip to show you me flipping out in the store. Y'all, I'm in Target. You see my child's hand. The Black History stuff is out. I want a baby, but I don't want a baby. I'm not having no more babies. It's out. My cart is full. Because I have to get something for the whole family. But, yes. I am too excited. And I met a friend while I was here. A new friend. Yeah, we got to look at the books and stuff. Okay. But, um, yeah, I went ahead and bought everything that I could convince myself to buy today. Like, I told them to do some price checking on some stuff. And then I was like, it don't matter. Just, just swipe it. Because if I come back in here later and y'all don't have it, I'm going to be upset. So, I just spent some money. Because at least I had money to spend. Thank God. Came into the new year prosperous. Um, but I want to show you guys what I got. Starting with this t-shirt. Now, the funny thing is I already filmed a good chunk of this video or thought I did. I started and I stopped and I thought I started again, but I never actually pressed record. So <laughs> I folded some of what I had already, but I'm going to unfold this. I bought this t-shirt for all of my family um, in my household. So me, my husband, and my two boys, we will be rocking this Juneteenth t-shirt, especially on Juneteenth. I know my little one, he'll be gone because it's also Father's Day weekend, but I wanna make sure we all have matching shirts because we'll be packed that weekend. And we will rock these shirts definitely all of June and really all year round because who only wears a shirt one day out of the year? Not me. So we got four of those baby's still down there somewhere what really sent me looking for it though moving the camera sorry is this right here bold black and bougie it's a crop top it's a hoodie but i didn't want it crop top so it looked big because i got an extra large i don't want a crop top but i wanted this hoodie i was like i gotta get it and i know if i wait too long it won't be in the stores. Like, the stuff you like the most, if you don't have the money to go get it or the means to go get it right then and there, you all know it's limited. We only getting it till they run out. Like, they're not going to restock. So, I went and got that. And to make it even better, they got the sweatpants to match. So, I got the full sweatsuit because it got the strip going down the side saying bold, black, and bougie. So, I'll probably be wearing this tomorrow. Um, because, you know, Georgia, like the rest of the country, but really Georgia is having some black bipolar weather where we don't know if it's winter, spring, summer. It's freezing cold. It's hot as all get out. Tornadoes and torrential rains. And now it's the temperatures dropping again. Always going to be wearing a hoodie throughout this time of year. Uh, speaking of hoodies, my oldest son loves hoodies. So... I had to, I have to get something for everybody in the family every time this happens. But I particularly picked this one out for him. It says limitless. And it's in a large. It's kind of big for him, but he's a growing boy. Um going to high school next year. <laughs> but yeah, he's go, he's a growing boy. So I got him this in a large so he can wear it this year kind of baggy. Hopefully he can still wear it next year because I don't know that boy eating eating up everything in the house. He's as tall as I am. When his dad saw him over the holiday, he shocked him too. 
And so to go with that, he got the full sweatsuit as well because they got the pants. And it says limitless down the pants leg. So he'll be surprised by that. Let me see this jean jaw string. I'm, I gotta protect these strings because the child will find a way to mess up what I got him. So this is the little t-shirt for the little one, the Juneteenth shirt. I'm gonna just put this down with the rest of them so I had it lumped together. Um, what else did I get? Uh, so we're coming up at the end of the clothing. This is also for me because I go crazy for this stuff, right? So I got in all shapes, beautiful in all shades. So beautiful in all shapes and shades. I love this. I like the green. Green is really like a color that I've really gotten into in the last few years. As you can tell, matches my head wrap, matches my sweater. But to match said t-shirt, I also got, which also matches my sweater, the hat that says the same thing. So got me a nice cute little outfit going with this t-shirt purchase as well. Um, Target, keep it going, keep it going. Cause you know what else? I made a friend in Target today in this black history line um, area. I don't have friends that look like me up here. I have the neighbors who are friends of all other backgrounds. But this is the first time I met somebody that looked like me. And we was like, I gotta get your number, I gotta get your number. We both got two boys. She don't live too far. Like She do everything with her kids right here by my house. So I exchanged numbers with her and she was like, go look, they got records, they got books. Oh, excuse me, y'all, I just ate, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, so I made a friend today and I'm excited to um, meet up with her and hang out and get to know each other. So speaking of the books, she told me to go check out. This will be the last of my haul. Um, I had to get this little notebook. Black futures are bright with a black boy on the front. Um, designed by a Spellmanite, I can see on the back. And I just feel like this is a beautiful notebook. I love notebooks. And I wanna give it to my oldest son. You can use it as a planner. I write. He could do all of his studying in it. Like, I just found it to be very pretty. Um, and then for the little one who is bouncing up the stairs, I got the ABCs of HBCUs, the ABCs of Black Wall Street, and Black History is World History Coloring Book. I just had to get it. You see his hands right here in the way. <laughs> Take it. Um, why not get things to inspire your black children, especially when they're growing up, not around too many of their own. You have to instill pride in them. So thank you, Target. Keep it going. Like I'm saying, y'all gonna get my money because I, the only other thing I bought in Target was a couple of craft sets out of the dollar spot for the little one. I spent over two hundred dollars today. <laughs> I kind of did it, but um, I did use that Target red card and got my 5% off. So thank you guys for watching. That's my Target haul for today and happy new year. And I'll see you later.